G'day viewers, welcome back to the channel. My name's Brett, this is a YouTube channel about getting fit over 50. What really happens to you when you do hardcore calisthenics and get into good shape and condition at the age of 55. Now today viewers, I've you haven't seen me for a couple of weeks. I've been out on the push bike, training hard, getting an hour and between an hour and three hours a day on the push bike and really starting to lean out viewers from riding the bike. I've nearly done a thousand miles on the new bike. It's been going very well. When I do a thousand miles, I'll do a bit of an update on the bike. But for today, I thought I'd come for about an hour's drive inland to the wine wine conservation area and we'll have a little um, ride through the rainforest and see what we can find. It's about midday today. It's a beautiful um, spring day. It's quite warm and we're going to have a look through this magnificent rainforest. It's absolutely magnificent in here, viewers. I'm sure we're going to be able to find some um, inter interesting things. So I'll get on the bike, I'm ready to go, and we'll see what we can find on the way. Let's begin. Okay, so I'm kitted up, ready to go, viewers. This is going to be some great gravel riding because we've been mainly on the um, pavement and a bit of mixed terrain where I live. So this is going to be fun. We'll put the bike out, test on a bit of the gravel. I can tell this is going to be a fantastic ride, viewers, so I'll see, let's hang on for the ride. So here we are, viewers, not even mi minutes in, into the ride, and it's just led us into this unbelievable valley with stream running through. Magnificent, the trail continues up there. This is going to be fun, let's go. I'm just going up this mega steep corner. Here, boom. Doesn't look like much. It's a really steep incline. Woo! Now viewers come, we're in the heart of the rainforest. Look down here in this creek bed and have a look. Yeah.
northern New South Wales viewers, about an hour's west of Byron Bay. This is the Wine Wine Natural Conservation Area. We'll continue on. Okay, viewers, we're back on um, on double track now. We've been um, struggling through the bush. There's lots of um, ups and downs. Very demanding riding, very hot. I'm kind of a bit lost. I think we're heading back to um, where we started from now, so um, it's not far to go. I don't know if we'll go do much more. We'll have a look and see how far we've done when we get back and um, figure out what we're going to do. <clears throat> Certainly a good way to burn off the calories, views, I'll tell you that. So here we are on a bit of more dedicated gravel road views. I'm just heading back to the last stretch. It's a slight incline. I don't know, it's pretty steep and gravelly. This has been a great little ride. I look forward to coming back up here at a later date and um, doing a bit more exploration. Certainly some quality gravel roads like this and um, some of those tracks through the those spy trails through the rainforest are pretty hard going certainly a little bit more tougher than the uh, easy bike paths around the beach we are sort of shaded by the sun it is kind of cool in the rainforest but um, it's still pretty hot. Wow. This is pretty good viewers. Pretty good quality, quality way to spend the, spend the day getting fit. So here we are viewers, I finally made it back. I got a bit lost there. We had to do a bit of backtracking and um, double backing. Um, I think that'll probably do for the do for the day. It was pretty um, intense. We'll have a look on the um, on the Strava, but there was some bloody hell heap steep climbs and steep descents and you have to go slow on the descent the track's quite rough so we'll get back and we'll have a look at the stats we're just back at the car now probably only done about 10 12 kilometers it's um double and then um, when you're off road you get so much harder of you not to mention the high humidity of the rainforest makes it um Makes it tough going. It's nice and cool in spots, and then not so cool in other spots. So here we are back at the red car. So viewers, that was a good little, um, just under 10 kilometres ride with a 303 metres of elevation gained. Um, it's quite tough riding through those trails compared to um, on the tar and pavement, but it was very enjoyable. It's very scenic and. Um, magnificent to get out and enjoy the um, national parks we've got in the area so stay tuned viewers there's going to be plenty more coming up we're going to get back into the training soon but we're just using the bike at the moment to continue to lean out we're just enjoying it we're just loving life so anyway stay tuned stay motivated keep on the program everybody there's going to be heaps more coming up subscribe hit the like all that peace out i love you all